All right, listen up, all you chocolate and coffee fanatics. Your favorite time of year has arrived. We have all the details this morning. It's the fifth annual Chocolate and Coffee Festival, and here to tell us all about it is Dean Strober and Tim McNam McNamara. Right. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for joining us. Thank, Thank you for having us. Let's start with the Chocolate and Coffee Festival. Is it chocolate? Yes. And coffee? Perfect. Yes. I got it right. I don't know if it's the other way. It's this weekend, right? It is. Uh, 10 to 6, Saturday and Sunday out at Expo New Mexico. Okay. How many vendors so far? It grows every year. Uh, we're looking at about 140 different chocolatiers, coffee roasters, bakers, cake makers, candy makers. Um, it's a lot. Anything you could really think of that yeah. really has to do with chocolate and coffee, right? It's a, and it's a big umbrella. Exactly. Okay. Is the number actually up from last year? Yes. It goes, years? Not only does it go up every year, but we see more and more food vendors. I mean, okay. we're all, we are certainly have vendors that are culinary in nature and some that do some really great products with cocoa butter. Right. Um, but there's more food on offer than ever before. And we're not just talking about the typical maybe chocolate bar. We're talking about really delicious chocolate treats. Exactly. Right? As Tim is going to get into the details a little bit like what Elixir does, but it's chocolate truffles. It's, uh, you know, bean to bar chocolates. It's tastes and flavors that you've never seen or heard of before tasted and then of course the the donuts and the cupcakes and the you know I mean the the pastries it's incredible and then the coffee it's just phenomenal absolutely and Tim you are the owner of Elixir I correct? am the co-owner co co okay chocolates. tell me about that you guys specialize in really kind of gourmet chocolates right we, we do we do handcrafted artisan style truffles and caramels and turtles and all of that stuff it's all made by hand right here in town my partner Larry and I have been doing it for about 20 years. Okay. About 10 years ago, we started Elixir Boutique Chocolates to really get the high end stuff. And yeah. so we make 35 varieties of truffles. 35, 35 different, different varieties? Different varieties. We're making one especially for the show this weekend. It's oh, wow. Two layer truffle with a layer of coffee and a layer of Bailey's Irish Cream. Wow. So you get your coffee that and Bailey's and one truffle. So that's our that's show exciting. special. Yeah, it is. <laughs> that sounds delicious. Perfect. Okay, so what did you bring for us today? Because well, I noticed I'm, you have a wide assortment here. All the stuff here in front is from Elixir Boutique Chocolates, um, all handmade, like I said. Are you ready for a taste? I am. I am. I'm I always have, ready for a taste. Are you kidding me? I have one of my favorite truffles. Okay. That is a Dulce de Leche okay. milk chocolate truffle, and it's also a two-layer truffle. It's mm. a handmade Dulce de Leche caramel with a layer of... This is really rich. It is. Mm. This is really good. Thank you. And yeah. A layer of coffee um, ganache in there also. Oh, good. Uh, yeah. But we have we have good luck with um, our turtles, especially okay. these these are salt back turtles. Uh, one of my inventions. It's a handmade caramel. I Those make it are all very myself. interesting because typically you don't see the little legs poking out. Yeah. We work very <laughs> hard to make them as perfect as we can make them, laying yeah. out the nuts and the handmade caramel. And then we, we lovingly call them saltwater turtles because nice. they have a little salt on their backs. So. That's nice. true. Yeah. And these are some of the other vendors that are going to be here. Mm -hmm. Of course. I mean, festival. certainly some of the local favorites. I mean, Cake Fetish and the Candy Lady. But we've got coffee roasters from all over uh, the state and from outside the state. Okay. And, you know, such as like what... With Elixir Chocolates, there are so many vendors at the festival who are not don't have stores, mm -hmm. and you're not going to find them anywhere. And that's one of the things that my wife uh, Lena and I are most proud of is bringing together businesses to meet the public and vice versa, right. who you're not going to find right. at a storefront. Now I have to ask, you know, when they go there, you know, if I want to go to the festival, am I going to be able to sample something before I purchase? Yes. Does yes. that happen a lot there? Yes, we. We'll give out probably 10,000 samples this weekend. Oh, wow. Yes. That's great because it sometimes is. you're like, I don't know if I want to get it. Yeah. But if you can sample it and it's great, then you right. pick up you know, a whole lot of it and take it home yeah. and then eat it the whole day, right? Exactly. <laughs> exactly. If it lasts that long. Right. It, it, if it lasts until you get home. Yes. That's true. Yes. That's true. Uh, I too. So you mentioned this is a huge festival. It's yes. been growing every year. How many exactly. people do you expect to attend? <sighs> Certainly. I mean, last year was about 17,000. Um, and we're really proud, again, you know, uh, Len and I to having built something with the community in Albuquerque. Mm -hmm. I mean, we could not have done it without Albuquerque. Uh, that has become probably the largest in the country, uh, you know, gathering of not just chocolatiers and coffee roasters, but the people who love them. Right. When and where? Saturday and Sunday at Expo New Mexico. It's 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. And all the tickets, you can buy tickets online ahead of time right now. That's at uh, chocolateandcoffeefest.com. Okay. So, yeah, chocolateandcoffeefest.com has all the information. All right. I want to thank you guys so much for joining us this morning. Thank, thank you for you. the sample. I'm going to finish it a little bit. All right. Next hour, we're going to be talking nothing but coffee. You don't want to miss it. We'll be right back.